Go ahead. Okay. I'm signing in, mm -hmm. which we already took it. Okay. And then I'm going to go to normal restock. Okay. I like to use the guided. Okay. Change restock mode. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go to the non-control mm -hmm. for today. Mm -hmm. And then it will all light up and it will guide me through. Right. Now, if I didn't want guided, mm -hmm. I can go to normal restock mm -hmm. and I could just do show item list. Okay. I don't like it that way because you're going to keep going in and out. Correct. Yes. So I'm going to go back in mm -hmm. and go to non-control, change it to guided because mm -hmm. it's a lot simpler. Right. And then you're going to open the packet. I'll just do the left side, right? Yeah. Yeah, sometimes, you don't want to bump anything else because sometimes right. they'll think you're Because the light to lights up on the right. Right. So lift it from the left. So that is a Satella Prime five. And then I would go in here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to, I pulled out what I have mm -hmm. that was in there, mm -hmm. six, because you always want to be sure to check your dates. And you Make always, sure you check the expiry date. Uh, yes, you uh, always. Before you fill in. Yes, right. you mm -hmm. always want the date that's going to expire the fastest. Right. The soonest. Mm -hmm. So I have six in there. That's mm -hmm. what it says. Mm -hmm. And it says 5523, mm -hmm. which that's not correct. It's actually 524. So I would change it. And then there is six, I'm adding 22. Mm -hmm. And then I like to put the newest ones at the bottom mm -hmm. because you want the oldest ones to be used first. And sometimes you gotta be creative to get these in the pocket. It's good to carry a scissor. I, yes. Scissors. Yeah. I do carry scissors. Okay. And then you just shut it. Mm -hmm. And then I shut the drawer. And I go to the next one. Mm -hmm. I'm going to open it up. You always want to see what's in there first. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, there's five. I will pro it. Right. And then this is where I get my scissors. You always want the right, correct amount. Mm -hmm. Because that way your reorder will be right. And you'll scan up here. Mm -hmm. It says there's only two prior. That's mm -hmm. incorrect. Mm -hmm. We actually have five. Change the bin level mm -hmm. and you will put in five. And the expiration date is 1024. That's good. And these are 225. So I'm going to keep the same date mm -hmm. and I'm going to add as many of these as I can fit 10, 20, 30, 40, mm -hmm. 50, 60. And these are where you have to use scissors. Okay. Whoops, I rescanned. Sorry. Sorry about that. Just made a goof. <laughs> So, just kind of cut them. Mm -hmm. Try to get them in there as best you can. Mm -hmm. You always want to be able to be able to shut the drawer without it being too tight. Right. This takes a little while. I wouldn't recommend pre-cutting them before you come to the unit because, you know. Then you're you gotta scan together. each tablet, so it's good to not to cut before you come here. Right? Cut, no. cut, scan, scan first and then cut. Right, if you wanna. Saves time. Save time, but you also, mm -hmm. I mean, you, you know, some, some may want to cut them first, but you only have one, thing to scan mm -hmm. one time. Um, you know, since when pharmacist checks, then mm -hmm. you don't have to worry. Otherwise, I, I'm not sure how you would do another scan. That's another topic. Okay, so this takes just a little bit, but just get them in there as best you can. Mm -hmm. And I know this is a fast 
mover and there's right. plenty of room so I kind of put a lot more than, mm -hmm. than it requested. The next drawer, this says Gallup Mountain. There's 14 in there. And it goes faster. Oh, you can put more in there too. Oh, yeah. This it's is a big pocket there. It's a big one. I got mm -hmm. 60. I'm going to put it. Oh, you got the 60. And it says that there's 14. There is. Yeah, Make sure you scan the tablet, also scan the bin, bin box. Yes, uh, this is just a double, double checking right. that you have the right drug. Right, yes. I'm going to change the date because there is no 228 in here anymore. Mm -hmm. So it's 331, 24. I'm putting 60. Okay. And 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. You should always double check what you're putting in just to be sure. And then go to the matrix. Okay, the matrix drawer automatically mm -hmm. is just, it, it, when you pick the matrix drawer, it opens up. Mm -hmm. And obviously it's, it's not it's locked. No leg, it's it's like unlocked cabinet, unlocked locked. bins. And yeah. a lot of times this mm -hmm. on hand is off because they don't count. Yeah, they, 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 they get don't in a do hurry the final and counting. they kind of okay. yeah, take right. some. So on the matrix store is a little different. Mm -hmm. You have to actually touch what you want. So mm -hmm. I'm going to the docky state and it will light up. Mm -hmm. and you're going to scan your product. Mm -hmm. And then over here, there's always let's just make sure you have the right product that is assigned to that particular drawer it says we have 18. i know this is more steps but it, it will help you in the end there's 18 in here which is good i'm adding 22. the expiration on this one is 426. Mm -hmm. we'll put that at the top Put the ones that are have more time at the bottom. That really will make your life easier. <laughs> Pretty common sense. You could Absolutely. You want always to use the top first. Just to use it. Right. And once again, mm -hmm. always put in the date that's going to expire the soonest. I can't the sooner, stress right, this yes. enough. The first, right, right. Because if not, when inventory comes around, mm -hmm. it'll mess things up a little bit. Okay. So you're going to the next item. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pick the multivitamin, mm -hmm. and it's going to light up mm -hmm. to guide you, just like the others. There's 22 in there. I'm going to try to put 50 in there, and sometimes you have to cut them. Their bin level prior is incorrect because I just looked. So you would say change bin level 22. I'm going to put 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 in there. Make sure you check the date. Date 10, And I know this seems monotonous. So mm -hmm. looking at dates, but like I said, it's very important. 124. Okay, we're gonna go. Sometimes if you do these, like, you gotta get creative. Mm -hmm. You pick and put them in there. Right. Oh, not dropping them. Oh, pardon me. And that looks pretty good. Okay. Go to the next item in the matrix drawer, mm -hmm. nicotine patch, which there is a lot of nicotine in here, so I'm not sure why it prompted me to pull that, so that makes me believe that the on hand is incorrect. Correct, yes. So if you see that... You see there's plenty of patches in there. Yes, yeah. exactly. That doesn't look right, so what yeah. I'm going to do, I'm going to scan. Mm -hmm. and, whoops, we're going to find out. Whoops, wrong one. I wonder. Okay, so that is a mistake that I just did. Mm -hmm. uh, that is not 21 milligram, mm -hmm. and it stopped me. See? Right, right. Yeah. So 
We'll, we'll skip so you this. went into the wrong drawer. Yes, I I I picked the wrong product. I yeah, it should have been this one. For and this video, lit, just to show up. how these things yep. can happen. Yep. Absolutely. I just made a mistake. Right. Um, it is actually the 14, and right. actually I didn't pull 14. So mm -hmm. for now, I'm just gonna skip it right. and say yes and come mm -hmm. back to that one because I actually pulled 21. Okay. So that's my mistake. That's why you always scan, Absolutely. just for that reason. Right. Which I'm glad that happened. So mm -hmm. now we can show that, yeah, I grabbed the wrong one. Lithium 450. Okay. I like to uh, write down on uh, paper what I'm bringing. Mm -hmm. So I have five in there. Mm -hmm. That balance is incorrect. You're going to change the bin level. Mm -hmm. Five. This is 614. That is incorrect too. Because as people use them, the date changes all the time. So I change them when I come down here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put 25 in. It asked for 24. I'm going to put 25 in. And strategically put them in to have them fit. Put them like on the side a mm -hmm. little bit. As long as the drawer will shut, mm -hmm. and you can always test that out. You can always open it up again before mm -hmm. you go to the next one, and it's right. opening just fine. So we'll go to the next one that's lit up. There's two metoprolol. Mm -hmm. I would have put more in, but um, I have to package more in the pharmacy. Mm -hmm. At the moment, when you have loose pills like this, you want to triple check yourself. But you know, pharmacist checks our work right. pr prior. Mm -hmm. You only get to scan one time, at least the way I learned. Mm -hmm. There's two in the drawer. Mm -hmm. Scan. There's two. I'm going to change the bin level because it's wrong. Mm -hmm. um, there is nothing expiring. In 1118, but there is something I brought, so we're going to keep that date. I'm going to put seven, it actually said four, 